it's Wendy Cranford. I am here today to teach you how to make this zigzag card. This has a belly band here at the bottom and then when it opens, it opens like this. Isn't that cute? And it closes like this. So I'm going to show you just the basics of how to create this card. The first thing you're going to want to do is have two pieces of paper 6 by 10 and then you're going to use your Stampin' scorer and trimmer and you're going to score both pieces oops let me bring out the arm here you're going to score both pieces at four six and eight okay Then what you're going to do is you obviously are going, I'm not sure if you can see this, you have the four inch piece here. So they're going to go opposite like so. And you're going to put this one onto this one. But first we have to cut the diagonal to make the zigzag. So you want to line up um, the bottom of your card for two inches from the bottom on each side. So on this side, I'm going to actually flip it over line it to the two inch mark and put a little score mark and then I'm going to line that score mark up with my top score mark over here the four inch piece okay and then I'm going to cut that off so you end up with a piece that looks like this and then we're going to do the same thing on this side here's the big four inch piece so this is the smaller pieces that are scored same thing I'm gonna line the bottom up at two inches put a little score mark then I'm gonna turn it and I'm gonna slice it from this four inch score line here all the way down to this score mark that I made over here so you end up with two pieces that look like this going in the opposite direction. So then all you have to do is put some adhesive on one side. Oh, I'm sorry, before you put the adhesive on the one side, you're going to want to ink all the edges. I used crumb cake and I inked all the edges before I put them together. So now we're just gonna put it together like so. And then you'll just fold in and back and in again. And there you have your zigzag fold card. And then to make the belly band, I simply cut a piece of designer series paper at two inches by nine and a half, and then layered a second piece of the T for two on top, and it's cut at one and a half by nine and a half. So that's it. That's how you make this super cute zigzag card. And you can decorate it however you'd like. I used the Oh Hello stamp set to decorate mine. And I really love how it turned out. Thanks so much for watching, everybody. I hope you have a great day. Bye-bye.